A common question lots of parents ask me is, my child doesn't really like maths or is struggling with it. How can I help them at home without it feeling like a chore? Hi, my name is Miss Garnet and I'm the founder of Maple Online Learning. Check out my three tips to help your child introduce maths into their daily routine and to really enjoy it. So my big advice to you is sometimes the best form of teaching is actually situational teaching. So I've got three situations that happen very regularly that you can apply and teach your child maths at the same time. The first one is use the car. So a car is a great informal place to learn. It's not like a very stuffy desk where your child feels that they're doing work. So you can make it a very light, fun experience by saying, let's do our five times table on Monday on the way to school. You can even put some background music. Next day, you could do division of your five times table and maybe give them a treat if they can remember some by the end of the week. Number two is to shop with your child. So children really love to feel useful and responsible. So perhaps you can involve them in your weekly supermarket shop. Tell them your budget and say, I'm really wanting to spend this amount. Can you help me add them all up and make sure we don't go over budget? Or you could even give them a little bit of pocket money so they can manage their own money. Even if you do online shopping, it's a great way for them to research and to search for products. You could say, which one is more expensive? Should we go for the cheaper option? And they can see what the difference is in price. Thirdly, cook with your child. First of all, they love it, especially if it's sweet, like cakes or cookies. But there is so much maths involved with cooking, whether that's weighing out ingredients using grams and kilograms, the temperature of the oven, and you can also remind them, I need help, can you tell me when it's five o'clock so I can take out the cakes? That's all really useful for them and they'll like it. So just to review, the three situations I'd recommend to introduce maths would be in the car, while you're shopping, and of course, while you're in the kitchen. Hopefully these tips are useful to you. and I look forward to seeing if they work.